Muffin McGraw won a national championship before she won her first outright Big East Conference title. It didn't take her or her squad nearly as long to take over the ACC. Notre Dame clinched the ACC regular season championship yesterday in their first year in the league. And with two games still to play, too, pretty impressive. With the win over Duke, the Irish also claimed an all-important double bye in the upcoming league tournament. Now, this is a team with much higher aspirations than simply a league title. But Sunday's milestone, nevertheless, is still a reason for the Irish to celebrate. It's good for us to, to have a, a trophy now, to, uh, to know that we accomplished something so far. Um, we, you know, we keep looking at the next game as the most important thing for us. And so to come in as our first year in the league and, and to win it, I think, really gratifying. It feels great, especially to win it um, here at Notre Dame with, with the best fans in the country, in my opinion. Um, it, it's definitely really special, um, just, for, just to do it for coach. Um, and just as a senior, yeah, it's amazing. Really everybody, I mean, has had just great moments all year long, so it's, it's been very rewarding. Now the Irish will play their final home game of the regular season this Thursday. That's against 14th ranked North Carolina. In addition, sophomore Jewel Lloyd was named the ACC's Player of the Week as well as ESPN's National Player of the Week. She averaged more than 25 points per game last week in three victories for the Irish. Lewis Nix on display today at the NFL Combine. 